Hi guys, Marcus here and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update, August 20th, 2023. I release episodes every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday between 7 and 10 p.m. Pacific Time. This is episode 727 and the rundown with timestamps is in the description box below. Now, because I use Chinese names quite a bit on my show, if you want the English spelling of them, you can turn on subtitles. I create them myself. In today's episode, Love You Seven Times responds to acclaims of plagiarism. Yang Zi and Xu Kai are photographed on the set of their latest drama, Story of Joy. Zhang Ruoyun is photographed on the set of his latest drama, Joy of Life Season 2. And Zhao Liying shares photographs of her son for the first time and attends a brand event. We'll get to the top 10 Chinese web and TV dramas of the week as we do every Sunday. But first, here's what's recently premiered, three dramas for today and the past few days. There's Legend of the Undercover Chef, which I referred to in my last episode as Legend of the Magpie Sword Sect. The wuxia comedy drama stars Zhao Penshan and Song Xiaobao and premiered on August 18th. Zhao Penshan is Changhai, the skillful leader of the Magpie Sword Sect. He goes on a mission to secretly investigate a mole in the Imperial Palace. However, he doesn't want to raise any suspicion by suddenly disappearing. So he gets his twin brother, Chang Chai, a cowardly chef, to assume his identity as sect leader. Comedy ensues. The drama is slated for 40 episodes and is available on Wii TV with English subs. Then there's Fake It Till You Make It, a modern drama starring Elvira Chai and Elvis Han. It premiered on August 18th as well. According to Baidu, Elvira Chai is a junior lawyer who's facing trouble in the workplace as she's being forced out by her colleagues. On top of that, she faces pressure from her parents who want her to get married. She meets Elvis Han, a charming investment banker, while on a plane. The two eventually hatch a plan to pretend to be a couple to appease her parents. Fake It Till You Make It is slated for 14 episodes and is available on Mango TV with English subs. Lastly, there's the costume drama The Legend of Zhuo Hua. It stars Jing Tian and Feng Xiaofeng and premiered yesterday, August 19th. According to Tencent, Jing Tian is the titular Mu Zhuo Hua, a career-minded female official who resists traditional marriage and is determined to gain fame in the imperial courts. She meets a powerful general in Feng Xiaofeng. The two start out trying to use each other for their own purposes, but eventually fall for each other. The Legend of Zhuo Hua is slated for 40 episodes and is available on Wii TV with English subs. That's it for what's recently premiered. Moving on, here's a story that trended a few days ago. According to this Sina Entertainment article, Love You Seven Times was accused of plagiarism. Its props department responds with an apology. Love You Seven Times is a recently premiered costume drama starring Yang Xiaoyue and Ryan Ding. A few days ago, netizens brought up similarities between a sword used in Love You Seven Times, seen here being unsheathed by Ryan Ding, and one used in The Legend of Qin. You guys can judge for yourselves. Netizens also brought up similarities between the lyrics of a theme song used in Love You Seven Times and one used in The Legend of Qin's animated series years ago. In response to this, a supposed crew member from Love You Seven Times Props Department took to Weibo with a statement. Going by the name Shenhai Da Fan Tuan or Deep Sea Big Rice Ball, this person wrote, Hello everyone, I am the staff member responsible at the time for the prop sword of Love You Seven Times. I bought the prop at a props and weapons store in Hengtian Studios. At the time, I just thought this sword was very good looking, good for the camera. After I got it, I made some additions and changes to it. I had no idea it was from The Legend of Qin. So sorry. My apologies to fans of The Legend of Qin and the crew of Love You Seven Times. It was my negligence that ruined the hard work of the crew. This person added later on that they had gone back to the prop store to tell them not to sell that sword anymore so as to prevent the same thing from happening again. Love You Seven Times also released a statement saying that indeed it was their mistake. Their props master bought the sword and they didn't check to see if it was in other original works. They added that they are, quote, urgently fixing the relevant images and have contacted the Legend of Qin for authorization matters, unquote. 
This might explain why episodes 19 and 20, which were originally scheduled to air on August 17th, were reportedly postponed. The Legend of Chin, which is based on a novel series and has been adapted into a drama and animated series, also released a statement to say that Love You Seven Times had not communicated or consulted with or obtained any authorization from them for music, video and props and that their lawyers are investigating. That's it for drama updates, moving on celebrity updates and today we begin with Yang Tzu and Xu Kai who were spotted on the set of their latest drama. The two stars are currently filming the modern drama, Story of Joy. Here they are embracing for a scene. Here is 28-year-old Xu Kai hanging out, waiting for the next setup. And here is 30-year-old Yang Tzu doing the same, dressed in white, arms folded. The two were photographed while filming on location. Story of Joy held its booting ceremony in mid-June. Here are the two stars at the event. The drama also shared a video of the two stars at another event where they spoke about the project and collaborating with each other for the first time. Both stars have huge fan bases, so anticipation is high. When the drama eventually airs, we'll almost certainly have huge amounts of traffic. Story of Joy is based on a novel of the same name and revolves around a daughter's strained relationship with her mother, Yang Tzu being the daughter. Her mother's excessive intervention in her life leads to her splitting up with her boyfriend. Eventually, she decides to break away from her mother's grip and focus on her work. That's when she meets Xu Kai, a professional hotel manager, and the two strike up a partnership. Story of Joy is slated for 38 episodes and will stream on Tencent. Also spotted recently was Chang Ruoyun on the set of Joy of Life Season 2. In a GIF recently circulating Chinese social media, the 34-year-old actor is seen filming a scene while sitting in a wooden wheelchair. In Joy of Life Season 2, Zhang Ruoyun reprises his role as Fan Xian, who in Part 1 engaged in a deadly political struggle with the Emperor. Joy of Life Season 2 is still in the midst of filming. Quite a few leaked photos have been circulating around. I will update again if and when they announce their wrap. Next up for celebrity updates, Cao Liying. But before we get to her, just to say that this show wouldn't be possible without you guys tuning in, so I thank you all for your support. If you enjoy the content, do like and subscribe, and don't forget to click that notification button for more updates. If you'd like to contribute, consider giving this video a super thanks. It is the heart-shaped button with a dollar sign below this video. All funds support the show and keep it going. Or you can check out my Patreon page, where for a dollar or more a month, you'll have access to perks like recaps, requests, and have your questions answered. Alright, some Cao Liying updates now. Recently, she was pictured attending an event in Shenyang for Longjin. According to Sohu Entertainment, the 35-year-old actress, who is ambassador for the Swiss luxury brand, wowed in a sparkly blue dress and charmed those present when she took the mic. About a week before this event, she was supposed to attend a live event in Nanjing, but that was cancelled and changed to a live stream. Fans who had planned to catch a glimpse of her at the Nanjing live event were obviously disappointed, but Cao Liying's fan club did offer to reimburse them for travel and hotel expenses. It was a move that was lauded by fans and netizens in general. And just a few days before that, the topic Cao Liying shares picture of Sun Xiang Xiang for the first time trended on social media. On August 7th, Cao Liying shared these photos. This one on the right is a literal mirror image of her son doing a high kick while hiding his face behind mummy's back. As the topic implies, it was the first time she had ever shared photos of her son, nicknamed Xiang Xiang, which translates to think think. Cao Liying had Xiang Xiang, who is now 4 years old, with actor Feng Xiaofeng. The real to real couple got married in 2018 and divorced in 2021. On that note, it's Sunday today, so time for the Top 10 Chinese Dramas of the Week, edition 186, August 20th, 2023. The data is provided by V-Linkage, a marketing consultant company based in Shanghai. They provide top drama charts every day. In this segment, the drama standings are based on their 7-day total points, beginning last Sunday and ending yesterday. We begin with the top 10 web dramas. The list is based on view counts on Yuku, Aichi, and Tencent, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. 
Number 10, Destined, the costume drama stars Bai Qingting and Song Yi. Number 9, The Lost 11th Floor, the modern drama stars Pan Yueming and Cheng Shu. Number 8, Sweet Games, the modern drama stars Viva Ho and Win Win. Number 7, The Legend of Anle, the costume drama stars Dil Raba and Simon Kong. Number 6, You Are Desire, the modern drama stars Zhuang Dafei and Zhou Yiran. Number 5, The Longest Promise, the costume drama stars Xiao Chan and Ren Ming. Number 4, Young Blood Season 2, the costume drama stars Steven Zhang and Zhou Yutong. Number 3, Love You 7 Times, the costume drama stars Yang Chaoyue and Ryan Ding. Number 2, Mysterious Lotus Casebook, the costume drama stars Cheng Yi, Joseph Cheng, and Aero Xiao. And number 1, Lost You Forever, the costume drama stars Yang Zi, Zhang Wanyi, Deng Wei, and Tan Jianchi. Lost You Forever is champion for a third week running. It garnered 618 points. Next up, here are the top 10 Chinese TV dramas of the week. The list is based on TV ratings and social media discussions in China. Number 10, The Youth Memories, the retro drama stars Xiao Chan and Li Qing. Number 9, Be Your Own Light, the modern drama stars Liu Tao, Qing Hailu, and Liu Yuning. Number 8, Fuchun Mountain Residence, the village drama stars Liu Tuan Tuan and Pan Zhiling. Number 7, The Knockout, the modern drama stars Zhang Yi and Zhang Songwen. Number 6, All the Way to the Sun, the modern drama stars Lan Li and Wang Yang. Number 5, Once and Forever, the modern drama stars Zhang Yishan and Guan Xiaotong. Number 4, Fireworks of My Heart, the modern drama stars Yang Yang and Wang Churan. Number 3, Imperfect Victim, the modern drama stars Zhou Xun, Liu Yijun, and Jelly Lin. Number 2, Winter and Lion, the military drama stars Du Chuan and Wang Ziqi. And number 1, The Infiltrator, the Republican era drama stars Huang Xiaoming and Jiang Xing. The Infiltrator ends the week with 518 points, making it champion for a third week running. And there it is guys, hope this gives you an idea of what dramas are hot in Chinese drama land at the moment. Tune in again next week to see how your favorite dramas perform. And that brings us to the end of this episode. Have a great weekend and I'll see you guys Tuesday. As always, stay safe and I wish you clear blue skies, good health and happiness. Until next time, cheers.